Hey guys, what is up? Ray here for the Yu-Gi-Oh! Council. Sup, sup, sup. We got the full confirmed effect for Berserker Soul, and it is dumb. Basically, it's going to allow you to put 5,500 damage into your opponent and swarm the board with a deck like Sylvan's. I'm going to show you how. Basically, here you go. <clears throat> Here's Berserker Soul. I'm going to read off the effect. When a monster you control inflicts 1,500 or less damage to your opponent by a direct attack, discard your entire hand. And basically look at top card of your deck, and if it's a monster card, send it to the graveyard. If you do, inflict 500 to the opponent. Then repeat this effect up to 7 more times, or until you exaggerate, I cannot pronounce that word, a non-monster card. If a non-monster card is shown, place at the top of your deck, you can only activate one Berserker Soul per turn. So pretty much in a deck like Sylvan's, that don't really run lots of spells or monsters, not only will they get their effects, but you can burned by 800 for just attacking with a little 1500 guy. Sylvans have ways of doing it. Clear the field with stuff and then just summon a little 1500, do the punch, drop Berserker Soul. I can see this running at like 2. Um, I, so, I still think Curry Vault is going to be better. Uh, Curry Bandit, I'm sorry. Curry Vault. Curry Bandit going to be better for the deck, but hey. So, I'll leave a link down below so you can see this for yourself in the whole article where they talk about how how um, Yugi used Breaker, which you can't even use Breaker with this version, which is BS, jokingly. But they even tell you you can use it with Sylvan's and stuff, and just be dumb. So, Sylvan's getting a lot of support out of Dragons of Legend. So if you guys like what you see, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. Tons of news videos are coming your way. Peace.